2016 coming at you live from Savannah, Georgia, Georgia, Georgia. Take it over. Are you all awake now? Are, Hi. You, are you awake? So today we're going to do a fun little Disney World souvenir haul. Yeah, we kind of took a couple Just days a few things. and went down to Walt Disney World mm -hmm. about two weeks ago. So we um, were in Disney for just a few days and um, we stopped at the character warehouse on the way home on International Drive and we probably no. will, will never go there again. One, well. the parking was really bad and I don't know, it was just, the store wasn't as big as the one on Vineland that we've been used to going to. And I just... I guess my question is, anybody who lives in Florida that watches this, that would have been one, two, two weekends ago? Mm -hmm. uh, wait, not this past weekend, but the weekend before. Uh, was Florida's tax-free weekend that weekend? Mm. Holy crikeys! Um, I think it was. I don't know, because Georgia's was last weekend, mm -hmm. or actually two weekends ago also, and mm -hmm. then... South Carolina's was this weekend, yeah. so a little crazy uh, down there at um, International Drive. And yeah. to be honest with you, we all been told that um, oh, I'm not picking on it. Go there, please. Mm -hmm. Go, 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 go. Yeah, it was still but fun. compare Vine to International. Um, the last time we went to Vine, we liked so it a little bit better. better. So and it's closer too mm -hmm. to um, Disney yeah. Springs, about two miles, if that. So go to both. Mm -hmm. You got to go to both. Got to go to both. But which one? Pine. Pine. Yeah, that's the one. Yeah. So, I guess the first thing we'll start with is just this fun little pen thing. I probably didn't need to get, but it was so cheap. What in the world? <laughs> he didn't, it was like one thing I put in at the last minute. It's a little mini mouse that stands on your desk, and then it opens up to a pen. And this was originally $9.95 in Makes the sense. parks. And it was Great for work. Only $2.99. And I'll go ahead and open it so that... Well, there went the value. So we can see what it looks like with the pen. So here it is. And then it opens up to a pen. <laughs> so isn't that... It's Very handy. It looks like it's probably going to fall apart really easily. Oh, uh, yeah. It's cute. Why not? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> wow. So, yeah, that was well worth it. <laughs> it's cute. It's cute. Very cute. Then... Um, one of the first things that I actually spotted and I was like super excited about this because this is something we can put in our living room or somewhere in our home um, and it make it, you know, doesn't really have to mesh with our colors because it's silver. It's actually from Disneyland. It's the diamond celebration and of course these are supposed to look like diamonds but this is a lot of our colors that we have in our house. Yeah. Since Corey and Matt won't invite us out to stay with them in Anaheim and take us to Disneyland, <laughs> this is about the only thing we can really get close mm -hmm. enough. So until they invite us, this is about all we have. So, mm -hmm. you know. But this is a picture frame, and so I definitely will take you know that out and put a picture in it. And this was originally twenty six ninety five in the um, parks at Disneyland and we got it for nine dollars and ninety nine cents. Look how it shines and glistens. It's so pretty. Love it. Very cute. Curly stuff. But it's gonna look pretty in our house. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Then the next two items are from the Disney holiday collection that I absolutely love and they still had a few things there. Got this cute little um, just little plate I guess you could call it. It's the it. smaller version of the bigger one that we yeah. already have. Yeah. So this one just it just says happy holidays and on the bottom the price was $9.95 and I got this for three dollars and ninety-nine cents. Definitely felt it was more worth four dollars than ten dollars. Cool. I kinda like them too. Yeah. And then I got a cute pot holder for Christmas 
Funny thing is though, I really don't use these because like the decorative ones because I don't want them to ever get gross. So this will just be pretty in our kitchen. And this was originally $12.95 and I'm pretty sure it's not marked down on this, but I'm pretty sure it came down to like $2.99. So super cute for the holidays. But hey, while we're at it for the holidays, yep. uh, this thing's been out for about what, two years now? <laughs> I think so. But it was $11.99 last Christmas and then it went down to $9.99 at mm -hmm. uh, the warehouse. And hey, why not? If we're going to go and during the holidays, mm -hmm. let's switch over, the wifey switch over. It's supposed to look like, you know, a vintage sweater. I love it. I think it's really cute. So, she'll wear it. Mm -hmm. Super cute. Yeah, pretty much. Mm -hmm. So, all right. Yep. And then something cute for our fridge. I love collecting magnets. And they have this lollipop, which hasn't been out that long. So I'm not sure, I guess maybe it's just not selling, but you know, it has the wooden lollipop stick on it. This was originally $14 in the park. I would never spend $14 on this. Can you eat it or you just look at it? Yeah, uh, you just look at it. Hold on, it's open. <laughs> Stop uh, it, uh, gross. No, it is. Uh, yeah. Yep, it's not. Oh. So it was marked down to $5.99, which, which is still sort of expensive, but um, I definitely think it was more worth $6 than $14, so. Super cute, gonna go on our yeah. fridge. But <laughs> then the next thing and the last thing, oh well, no, second to last thing from the outlet, Brad found another shirt. Hey, you know what? I know we haven't been on a Disney cruise mm -hmm. line yet, someday, but I'm not all. Um, yeah. you know. But anyways, for ten dollars and ninety nine cents, which was normally twenty nine ninety five, I like the color. Um, I figured I'd get it. You know what? You can't go wrong with the Disney Cruise Line uh, t-shirt established in 1998. Um, so, yeah, I like it. I like it. I'm going to wear it. I'm, I like it a lot. What was the price? I said. Oh, you did? Ten ninety nine. I What was the original price? Though? You didn't $29.99, say. I said. That was, I, I ah, didn't hear that. So, that's right. So, yeah, not bad. Not bad. Then, the last thing that we purchased was right before we checked out. And you want to hold it? I thought you were just going to offer a trophy to me. So, super cute. This is it just a black and sort of goldish bronze color statue. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, Hollywood Studios? Yes, this is where These they have These were like everywhere. Because this is a movie reel on the bottom here, and then this is a director's uh, megaphone. Yeah, what were they, how much were these? These are originally like $30. It wasn't very much. They're originally $29.95, and we mm -hmm. got it. We got it for $8.99. Yeah, these are cool. I mean, these yeah. could go anywhere in the house. They, yeah. They've got some weight to them. Mm -hmm. um, um, Ooh, as but to uh, yeah, these are actually really cool. Yeah, does it say anything down here on the bottom? No. Twenty nine. Twenty nine ninety nine. So yeah, I saw that and I'm like, oh, how much is it? I thought it'd be a lot more. I mean, there's nothing really too special to it. It's not like real gold or anything like that. It's just, I thought it was cute. Yeah. And it reminds us of Hollywood Studios. Yeah, love it. So those were the items that we picked up at the character warehouse. We ha we well, had a budget this time. We did. And there's only one thing that we purchased in the parks, and Sorry. this we got at Animal Kingdom on our first day. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. He's gonna do something. Okay, I'm just turn some lights. So it's a lantern that we got at Animal Kingdom at Pizza Fari, and it's really cool. It lights up, and you can actually replace the batteries in this, and so you can it changes colors. Yes, it is really a drink. See the straw. Yes, <clears throat> the straw, straw right there. there. And it's just really cute. Is it like really cheaply made plastic? Yeah, but it's really cool because on the bottom here it does say Animal Kingdom. And you know, I think it'd be fun to, you know, just have sitting around and everything. If and you want to blow 13 bucks, why not? Yeah, it was 13.99. No, no, 12.99. Oh, 12.99. But again, it was really cute and I couldn't resist getting one of them. We actually didn't even get the drink put in it because I didn't want to have it all sticky and gross and everything. So, definitely fun, but the cool thing is it does collapse down, so I was able to put it in my purse to walk around with. So, liked it. It was fun. Mhm. Mm and what else? What, what else did you get? Two special things. Hmm. Mm -hmm. What is this? It is a really cute Minnie Mouse cooler bag that Open it up. That Brad got me and had sent to the room. On the bottom here is an insulated cooler part, 
um, that you could put drinks or snacks or something. And in the top half there is a zippered pouch section. And inside I found a bag of Mickey Mouse kettle popcorn. And Brad got this from Disney Floral and Gifts. And it was really cute, it got delivered to the room, and I just love the bag. It's definitely, it could be used for a park bag or just, you know, going to the beach or something, but I just love how it looks. It's so cute. I love the bows. I love, like, the detail on the handles and, like, the little ruffle on the bottom. It's just so cute. But it's a really nice, like, durable bag, too, so this was our first time ordering a bag. $65. <clears throat> oh. Well, so $65 plus the popcorn Ten dollars is normally $9.99. Yeah. But so, and I've had this kettle of popcorn before. This stuff is really good. So let me tell you about that. Really good. If you don't know much about uh, Disney's floral and gifts, um, obviously a website that you can go to. I'm not, obviously I guess they're, it is owned by Disney. Um, sometimes I wonder if it really is. Um, had some issues with them once. Twice, um, sort of. The flowers didn't last very long. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think this is trip. my fourth or fifth time ordering from them. Mm -hmm. Second time having something sent to the resort. Uh, if you remember our hauls from back in February, uh, we had something sent. Uh, but uh, I had this sent. Um, just wanted to try it out and just see what the bag looked like. I think I paid for it to be embroidered. And, yeah, with her name on it. And I didn't say anything until now. I thought it was supposed to have Lindsay's name on it. They asked for her name, so oh. I didn't check on that, and I probably should. So anyways, it's, it's a nice little bag. The problem is with floral and gifts, it's not cheap stuff, meaning and, it's in the price. Yeah, and he did have to call, like, a couple times to get it delivered, so but, but we don't know listen, if that was Disney floral and gifts or listen, the hotel. Right? It's about the magic. Right, that's what I'm saying. So I think it's about the magic. it should have been there on a surprise instead of me sitting there waiting for it because we were trying to get back to the parks. Well, I had a call I had to yeah. be on and not be bothered. And Anyway. But it's still really cool. cute. Love it. Can't wait to open up this bag of popcorn. It'll, you know, make you feel like you're in the parks. And you can get this popcorn at any of, like, the shops and stuff, especially, like, um, the confectionery in Magic Kingdom, which we all know is my favorite bakery in the parks. So, so I hope you guys enjoyed this haul wasn't the longest haul by any means but we still had fun and enjoyed sharing these items with you guys and yeah nothing exciting just uh, basic stuff but it's always mm -hmm. nice to see new things mm -hmm. that you could possibly get from the past to the future to the present <laughs> but you know what i mean all of the above yes but we hope you all have a great night and we will see you all real soon go back to my savannah life living have a good one bye take care <laughs>